Would you clap like a winner, man? Would you clap like a winner, man? Would you clap like a winner, man? Given me victory, I yeah, he has given me victory. I yeah, God has given me victory. I yeah, 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 he has given me victory. I yeah, I yeah, I yeah, I yeah, I given me victory. I Hallelujah, 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 Children of God, children of God, oh children of God, children of God, would you shout hallelujah, shout hallelujah to the Lord right now, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lord, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 Walls are falling in his name. Oh, walls are falling in his name. Do you believe that? Chains are breaking in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Oh. Walls are falling in his name. Oh, walls are falling in his name. Sickness healing in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Oh, walls are falling in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Oh, walls are falling in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Cancer disappear in his name. Fibro give way in his name. Tuberculosis in his name. Every disease in his name. Chains are breaking in his name. Oh. And walls are falling in his name. Oh, chains are breaking in his name. So children of God. Oh, children of God. Oh, children of God, children of God, children of God, would you shout hallelujah, shout hallelujah to the Lord right now, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lord, hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 
Challenge, oh. You are the most high. You are big, 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 oh. You are the most high. Oh, Jehovah, you, you are, are the most high. know we serve a great God? Anybody know we serve a good God? My God is a good God. Oh. My God is a great God. He lifts me up. I said he lifts me up. He turns me He turns me around. He turns me around. He turns me around. He sets my feet upon the solid rock. Upon the solid rock. And now. offering here tonight and now I'm clapping and now I'm clapping and now I'm singing and now I'm singing and now I'm singing Tonight will be a night to be remembered. Yeah. Tonight will be an unforgettable night. Yeah. Great and mighty things have been happening since we started on Thursday. Tonight is the final night. And tonight is the grand finale. There will be distribution of miracles everywhere. Yeah. All you need to do is to believe, confess, and you will possess your possession. In Matthew chapter 8, verse 16, when the evening was come, they brought unto him many that were possessed with devils, and he cast out the spirits with his word, and healed all that were sick. Tonight, there will be no exception. 
I will never let him go unless he blesses me tonight. Let's close our eyes for prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for the great things you have been doing. Thank you because of the wonderful, marvelous things you have been doing. Thank you for saving the sinners globally. Thank you for healing the sick globally. Thank you for delivering the oppressed globally. Thank you for your servant you have anointed to bring deliverance to the globe. Lord, we pray that tonight being the final night, you will do what has never been done since we started. Sinners will be saved tonight. Sick people will be healed tonight. Oppressed will be delivered tonight. The weak shall be strengthened tonight. The backsliding shall be restored tonight. We pray that as we come before you, we will not go back empty-handed. There will be no exception here tonight. You will touch everyone. You will touch every heart. You will touch every life. You will touch every soul. Use your servant in a mighty way to bless your people all over the world tonight in Jesus name we have come with great expectation our expectation shall never be disappointed release your power from heaven tonight thank you because we know you have answered in Jesus name we pray another amen another global amen. amen we remain standing as we sing together there shall be showers of blessing there shall be showers of blessing this is the promise of love there shall be seasons refreshing sent from the savior above there shall be showers of blessing precious reviving again over the hills and the valleys, sound of abundance of rain. There shall be showers of blessing. Send them upon us, O Lord. Grant to us now a refreshing. Come and now honor thy word. There shall be showers of blessing. Oh, that today they might fall. Now, as to God, we are confessing. Now, as on Jesus, we call. There shall be showers of blessing if we but trust and obey. There shall be seasons refreshing if we let God have his way. Showers of blessing, showers of blessing we need. Mercy drops round us are falling, but for the showers we plead.
And we shall keep standing as we enter into this uh, session of prayer. Let's get before the Lord, thanking him for what mighty great things he has already done in the entire five days that have gone. Today is the grand finale. Let's thank the Lord for uh, his goodness and his mercies that has been uh, uh, showered upon his people all around the globe. Let's thank him, let's praise and glorify the Lord. The psalmist says, I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart. Let's thank him for uh, the great deliverances, uh, the salvation of souls, the blessings of the Lord that uh, the Lord has been showering upon his people. Let's thank him for his servant, our Father in the Lord, our General Superintendent, Pastor Dr. W. F. Kumi, the convener uh, of GCK. Let's thank the Lord for how mightily he has been using him. Signs, wonders, and miracles have been happening uh, in this entire uh, the power that never fails could save. Let's thank the Lord. Let's praise uh, and glorify him for what he has done. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Let's get before the Lord. Let's rise up our voices and uh, let's beseech the Lord that uh, he will conserve uh, the fruits of GCK, those that have given their lives to Christ, those that have been converted. Uh, the Bible says, All that the Father giveth me shall come to me, and him that cometh to me I will in no wise cast out. I will in no wise cast out. Let's pray that the Lord will convert, con, uh, conserve his own. All the converts will be sustained through follow-up, uh, through uh, the teachings of the word that are going to be given, and through the grace of God, the power of God himself will be upon them, and they will be preserved. They will be kept in the faith. Uh, they, will not, they will not derail out of the faith. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Let's get before the Lord also. Let's pray that... Uh, uh, the Lord will grant unto them strength and uh, grace as they are persecuted because of their faith, those newborn, uh, newborn in the faith, they will not give up. They will never lose hope. They will, not, they will not throw in the towel, but the Lord will preserve them. The Lord will give them ability to stand against all persecution. The Bible says in the book of Acts of the Apostles, chapter number 14, verse number 22, uh, confirming the souls of the disciples and exhorting them to continue in the faith, to continue in the faith, and that we must, through much tribulation, enter into the kingdom of God. Yes, tribulation will be there, but the grace of God to sustain them will also be there. Let's pray that the Lord will give them strength and grace uh, as the persecutions, the storms of persecution will assail against them. The Lord will be there to strengthen them. In Jesus' mighty name, uh, we have prayed. Let's get before the Lord now and uh, let's present uh, 
the uh, GCK uh, program unto the hands of the Lord. Let us pray that the Lord himself will sustain uh, the GCK uh, outreach the, the world over to the entire globe. Uh, that this open door of salvation of souls will keep on uh, marching on. Every nation will be touched uh, eventually uh, through the media, through the internet, through the television, through the radio. Let's pray that this wave of the power of God through GCK will not die off, will not fizzle off. The Lord will sustain it. The Lord will cause it to reach unto other places as well. As the, uh, as the man of God has had the vision already, let's pray that the Lord will sustain this vision in him that as Paul did desire that I must also see Rome, the Lord will be together with his servant to make him see all the places, reach all the places and the entire globe that uh, uh, his uh, heart has been set upon. In Jesus' mighty name, uh, we are prayed. Uh, let's also pray that the Lord uh, will preserve the truth that has been disseminated the world over. It will not just be for fun. The people hearing the word and then not changing their lives, not being kept in their hearts and lives to be transformed. Let us pray that the word of God, the truth that they have heard will be preserved. The, uh, the knowledge of the word of God will abide in the people through the media, through the internet, through the radio, television, and every means the truth will be uh, preserved in their, in their lives. The Bible says in the book of First Timothy chapter 2, verse number 4, who will help all men to be saved and come unto the knowledge of the truth. Number one, to come unto it, but number two, to abide in it. Uh, let's pray that the Lord will cause them to abide in that truth, and that truth will abide in their heart. In Jesus' mighty name, uh, we are prayed. But let's again lift up our voices, and let's pray that the fear of God will be prevalent. The fear of God, that uh, men will be living in their lives freely, not having the fear that uh, they'll be killed, tortured, maimed, or any kind of harassment for their life, it's your responsibility and mine to raise up our voices that the fear of God will prevail over every continent of this world, over every nation of this world, over every city, town, state, and every locality. The fear of God uh, will be there. There will be no uh, maiming of lives. There will, no, there will be no uh, uh, any kind of uh, kidnapping of, uh, of lives. There will not be killing that are uh, extrajudicial. Let us pray as as you have just had recently over there in the United States, uh, people just being killed like that, we're hearing of from upholding the earth, the stars, the moon, the sun, everything will collapse. But fret not, GCK Authority has announced the next level move. Christ comes and intervenes in your life. In the hospital there, you will not die. Christ, your great transformer, this December will lead you to triumph. Zoom into your December 2022. From the land of honor and integrity comes two-in-one GCK live in Ekiti State, Southwest Nigeria, the Global Crusade and Retreat, December 22 to 27, 2022. A new level of Impact Academy for Youth, Young Adults and Professionals, titled Recharge to Excel, December 27, 2022, at 0600 hours GMT, all broadcasts live on satellite, radio, television, and all our social media platform. Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi says, You'll praise God. Amen. You'll give your testimony. And more, as excellent worship comes from the USA with Jonathan White, our guest music minister. GCK, the gospel to every creature. for gathering us in your presence this evening. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your strength. Lord, be glorified in Jesus' name. Father, we pray that as we sing unto you now, we pray that you accept our praises in Jesus' name. And I pray at the end of the day, Father, our souls will be revived in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion, we are here to worship God, hallelujah. We are on the mountain Zion, we are on the mountain Zion, we are here to worship God.
worship God. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are here to worship God. Hallelujah. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are here to worship God. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are here to worship God. Hallelujah. We are on the mountain Zion. We are on the mountain Zion. We are here to worship God. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Redeemer liveth. He liveth forevermore. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Jesus liveth. He liveth forevermore. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Redeemer liveth. I know my Redeemer liveth. He liveth forevermore. Hallelujah. He liveth, he liveth, he liveth forevermore. I know my Savior liveth, I know my Redeemer liveth, I know my Jesus liveth, he liveth forevermore. I know my Redeemer liveth, I know my Redeemer liveth, I know my Redeemer liveth, he liveth forevermore. Hallelujah. I know my Redeemer liveth, I know my Jesus liveth, he liveth forevermore. You are the Lord that changeth not, 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 you are the Lord that changeth not. Oh, you are the Lord that changeth not. 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 You are the Lord that. Oh, you are the Lord that changeth not. 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 Oh, Father, you are the Lord that changeth not. Pass me not, O oh gentle Savior, yeah, my humble cry. While on others thou art calling, do not pass me by, do not pass me by, Savior, Savior. Hear my humble cry, hear my humble cry. Do not pass me by, blessed Savior, 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 Savior. Hear my humble cry while on others thou art calling. Do not pass me by, blessed Savior. Savior, 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 hear my humble, hear my humble cry. He is able, abundantly able to deliver and to save. Our God is able, abundantly able to deliver those who trust in him, who trust in him. Able, able. Abundantly able to deliver, to deliver, and to save. Able, able 
to deliver those who trust in him, who trust in him. Able, able, abundantly able to deliver and to save. Abundantly able to deliver those who trust in him. Is able, abundantly able to deliver, to deliver, and to save. Oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. Blessed Jesus, come down, come and manifest your power. In our lives, in our midst, come and manifest your power. Oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. Oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. Oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. He make impossibility possible. He make impossibility possible. He make the impossibility possible. He make impossibility. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He make impossibility possible. He make impossibility. Jesus. He make the impossibility possible. He make impossibility possible. He make impossibility possible. He make impossibility. Hallelujah. God cannot lie. He is not a liar. Oh, yes, God cannot lie. He is not a liar. Oh, God cannot lie. He is not a liar. Oh, God cannot lie. He is not a liar. Lie. He is not a liar. Our oh, God cannot lie. He is not a liar. There is power, power, wonder working power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, power in the blood of the Lamb. Power, power, wonder working power. In the precious Lord of the Lamb, there is power, power, wonder working power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is power, power. Power in the blood of the Lamb. Power, power. There 
there is power, power, power in the blood of the Lamb. Power, power, wonder working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. Only you can do what no man can do, Jehovah. Only you can do what no man can do, Jehovah. Only you can do what no man can do, Jehovah. Only you can do what no man can do, Jehovah. Only you can save, only you can heal, only you can save, only you can heal, Jehovah. What no man can do, Jehovah, only you can do, what no man can do, Jehovah. Anointing breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. By the anointing, Jesus breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. The yoke. By the anointing, Jesus breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke, anointing breaks. By the anointing, Jesus breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke, anointing breaks the yoke. By the anointing, Jesus breaks the yoke. Anointing breaks the yoke. I believe, yes, Lord, I believe. Yes, Lord, I believe. It is well with me. It is well with me. I believe. It is well with me. Is it well with you? Yes, Lord, I believe. It is well with me. It is well with me. I believe. Yes, Lord, I believe. It is well with me. It is well with me. I believe, yes, Lord, I believe it is well with me, it is well with you. I believe, yes, Lord, I believe it is well with me. Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray. For the Lord is seated on the throne. Expect a miracle when you pray. Oh yes, expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray. For the Lord is seated on the throne. Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a healing when you pray. Expect deliverance when you pray. For the Lord is seated on 
the throne. Hallelujah. When you pray, expect a miracle. When you pray, expect a miracle. When you pray, for the Lord is seated on the throne. Oh, yes, expect, expect a miracle. When you pray, expect a miracle. When you pray, expect a miracle. When you pray, for the Lord is seated on the throne. Nothing prayer cannot do. Jesus answer prayer. Nothing prayer cannot do. Nothing prayer cannot do. Nothing prayer cannot do. Nothing prayer cannot do. Nothing prayers cannot do. Nothing prayer 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 cannot do. Touch me one more time, O oh Lord. Touch me one more time, O oh Lord. I need a touch of the master. I need a touch of the Lord. Touch me one more time, O oh Lord. Touch me one more time. Jesus, touch me, touch me. I need a touch of the master. I need a touch of the Lord. Touch me one more time. Oh, Lord, touch me one more time. Touch me one more time, oh Lord. I need a touch of the master. I need a touch of the Lord. Touch me one more time, oh Lord. Jesus, touch me. Jesus, touch me, touch me. Oh Lord, I need a touch of the master. I need a touch of the Lord. Touch me one more time. Oh Lord, Jesus, touch me. Oh Lord, touch me, touch me, Jesus. Oh Lord. I need a touch of the master. I need a touch of the Lord. Touch me one more time. Oh, Lord. Unchangeable God, unchangeable God. Unchangeable God, unchangeable God. Unchangeable God. Unchangeable God, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, reliable God, reliable God, unlimited God, unlimited God, unlimited God, unlimited God, unlimited God, unlimited God. Unchangeable God.
Praise the Lord. Already our pastor has told you here that today, today is your day. Miracle. Power. Anointing. Every yoke broken in your life in Jesus' name. And for all the people who are joining us over the internet, streaming, in every location, anywhere you are, you should position yourself as if you are the only one I am talking to. Whatever the mountain, whatever the sickness, and whatever the infirmity, long-standing problem, tonight you are free in Jesus' name. And for everyone here, all your tears are wiped away. All your yokes are broken. And if you are there, you are concerned for somebody. That person you are concerned for, whether the person is here or not, you are standing for them. Their mountains will move away. Every evil power will be destroyed in their lives in Jesus' name. Raise up your hand for your blessing. Father, we thank you tonight. I bless your name for every brother, every sister, every boy, every girl, everyone here. I thank you for all our invitees. I thank you for those who have brought great, great problems before you. Tonight, touch their lives. Tonight, move their mountains away. Tonight, break every yoke. And let there be miracle for everyone in Jesus' name. Let there be confirmation in every life tonight. We thank you because we know you have answered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are blessed already. I'm reading from Matthew chapter 9, verse 29. Matthew chapter 9. Verse 29, and he touched their eyes, saying, According to your faith, be it unto you. According to your faith, be it unto you. That sentence coming from the Lord Jesus Christ is a principle that God himself always acts on. Anyone who comes before him, no matter your background, no matter your problem, no matter your tears, no matter even your sin in the past, and no matter your failure in the past, as you come in the presence of the Lord, and you come with faith and with expectation, you will not be disappointed. It's a God of love. Is a God of mercy and is a God of power. And because of his love and mercy, he bases every blessing he gives you on the, on the fact that you come, you believe, and what you are believing for will be done. According to your faith, be it done unto thee. Look at Mark chapter 9, verse 23. Mark chapter 9 verse 23 it says in verse 23 and Jesus said unto him and remember Jesus is the same yesterday today and forever and if Jesus were to talk to you directly physically tonight this is what he will tell you remember again no matter who you are and no matter where you are coming from, and no matter the challenges you have in your life, if Jesus were to talk to you personally, physically, one-to-one, -one, this is what he will tell you. Verse 23, if thou canst believe, all things are possible to him that believeth. That's what the Lord is telling you tonight. Your problems will soon vanish away. Your mountain will still soon move. 
and all those challenges of your life that you have been wondering how will this be done how will that be done tonight is the night it will be done he says if you can only believe believe all things are possible to him that believes i believe god tonight in your life all things are possible in your family all things are possible every challenge of your life all things are possible he will put laughter in your mouth joy in your heart look at luke chapter one luke chapter one verse 37 for with god nothing shall be impossible what load are you carrying what pain are you having? What sickness do you have in your life? Tonight, God has come to you personally. And he has come to make all things possible in your life. Somebody shout amen. amen. And Mary said, behold, the handmaid of the Lord, be it unto me. Be it unto me, be it unto me according to thy word. And it's unto you tonight according to the word you are hearing in Jesus' name. Tonight, before we pray, I want to talk to you on the great possibilities of faith in Christ. The great possibilities of faith in Christ. Once you put your faith in Christ, there are great possibilities. That moment, that time, you put that faith in Christ, you'll see all those mountains moving away. All the walls of partition and the walls of disturbance in your life, everything crumbling. You will see Satan fleeing away from your life. And every sickness you will see will just be dissolving and going away. The moment you put your faith in Christ, the great possibilities of faith in Christ. There are three things we're talking about tonight. Number one, asking. Asking. You will ask. Note this, everything you ask the Lord tonight is done. Yeah. Number two, appropriating. Appropriating. That means after you ask, then you stretch out your hand. What you claim, you are going to have. Because you can appropriate. Number three, acting. Acting. You will not just, you know, if you are down there, and you were immobile, and you were stagnant, and you were paralyzed, and you were blind, and you were incapacitated, you will act out your faith. You ask, you appropriate, you act. And those three words will drive miracle into your life. <laughs> Number one, asking in prayer, as a child asking in prayer as a child a child has just come into the world and he has not asked anything from the mother before and the mother ever said no and so she comes that little child comes with confidence and tonight as you ask forget about any failure in the past i prayed before forget about that I asked before, forget about that. I didn't get this before, forget about that. I was weak before, forget about that. Tonight is a new night. It's a new day. Asking in prayer as a child. Number two, appropriating the provision with confidence. Appropriating. Look at that. That is mine. Healing is mine tonight. Look at that. Strength is mine. Strength is mine tonight. Look at that. Provision is mine. Provision is mine tonight. Look at that. Miracle is mine. Miracle is mine tonight. It is confirmed in Jesus' name. <laughs> Appropriating the provision with confidence. Number three, acting like possessors and conquerors. 
acting like possessors and conquerors. When you sing, because you sing after the message tonight, you will sing like I am a possessor. I am a conqueror. And when you walk, you walk with your shoulders up because tonight you are a possessor and a conqueror. And when, when you talk, you talk with confidence and assurance because tonight you are a possessor and a conqueror. I am a possessor. I said I'm a possessor and I am a conqueror. You have conquered already in Jesus' name. Number one, asking in prayer as a child. Asking in prayer as a child. While the message is going on, you might remember what you need to ask. You write it down, judge it down. And then as we move on, there's something I didn't remember that before. Even though I've been waiting on the Lord from the morning, I remember now, jot that thing down. Everything you are asking tonight in prayer, the moment you open your mouth, the Lord will fill your mouth. In Matthew chapter 7, I'm reading from verse 7. Matthew chapter 7, and we're reading from verse 7. It says, ask and it shall be given you. Praise the Lord, there's no doubt. And praise the Lord, there's no unbelief. Praise the Lord, there is no uncertainty here. Ask, and it shall be given you. And it says, seek, and ye shall find. Seek, and ye shall find. You're finding it tonight. That thing you lost, you're finding tonight. And that child you lost, you're finding him tonight. And somebody that is running away from whom you've lost the person, you see the person tonight. It says, knock and it shall be opened unto you. The doors that were closed against you before, those doors are opened. My doors of opportunities are opened. I'm saying for yourself now, my doors of opportunities, they are opened. And my doors of breakthrough, they are open tonight in Jesus' name. Yeah. But see it.